good news from IK Multimedia. They have just released an update for T-Rex. In the T-Rex 4.2 update, T-Rex now provides full AAX compatibility. That's AAX 32-bit for Pro Tools 10 and AAX 64-bit for Pro Tools 11. So if you want to use T-Rex in Pro Tools 11, just make sure you click that AAX 64 option on the installer. So here we are in Pro Tools 11 and you can see I have the T-Rex shell open and I can load the different modules that I currently own. So we have a soft clipper here. We had an EQ open and not only can we load the EQ uh, clipper compressor, those kind of modules, we can also load the classic studio reverb modules that we own right within the T-Rex 4.2 shell here in Pro Tools 11. And furthermore, not only can we load all of our modules in the T-Rex shell, we can also load the single plugins as inserts right here in Pro Tools 11. So if you don't want the full shell, hey, that's fine. Just load the plugin that you want right on your channel. And you can see here what I currently have available. So a clipper, compressor, EQ, the metering suite, even our classic studio reverb modules can be loaded as singles here in Pro Tools 11 with this T-Rex 4.2 update. Now, if you're only seeing all your plugins available within the T-Rex shell and you're not seeing them available as single plugins for inserts in your Pro Tools mixer, then you need to open the custom shop and restore my gear. So make sure you close down Pro Tools first or any doll you have open. So close down your doll, open custom shop, make sure you click the T-Rex button and then click restore my gear. So after you click OK and T-Rex will go ahead and install the individual plugins for your doll, you can then reopen Pro Tools 11 and you should see the singles available. Now if you don't have the singles available, I was having a problem on my system where I needed to uninstall the Classic Studio Reverb and the T-Rex 3 standard versions. Uninstalled both of those, also uninstalled the Custom Shop and T-Rex CS 4.2, uninstalled all that. Then I just reinstalled T-Rex 4.2 only and then did restore my gear from Custom Shop and then I had access to all of my single plugins within Pro Tools. So if you were having the problem that I had, which most of you probably won't, but if you do, there's a potential solution. Just uninstall all your T-Rex and Classic Studio Reverb and then install only the T-Rex 4.2 installer and then restore your gear. So it's great to have another plugin available in Pro Tools 11. Now we have our EQs, compressors, limiters, clippers, and a whole reverb suite as well as the metering section. An absolutely great job from IK Multimedia. The basic model is completely free so you might as well go ahead and download it now. So to learn more about T-Rex and all the other great IK Multimedia plugins, go to ikmultimedia.com.